sweet little town they call Belfast. Apprentice to trade I was bound. And many easy hours, sweet happiness, I spent in that quaint little town. Till a sad misfortune came over me. Well, his name was James Reason Terrell, and uh, my mother was, was a Terrell. He was born in 1820. Uh, in Nichols County, Georgia. They migrated down to Florida to Marion County. His 13th child was born uh, eight days after he was, he was killed here. And it's just, you know, I don't know that much about him, but, uh, but I just know he's one of our family members. And so I feel some, some connection, you know, to the event here uh, that occurred, uh, you know, in, in 1864 and, and then the reenactment today. So I took uh, there many, many times uh, in the guard, we, we slept outside, sure, in tents or just laid down wherever we could. Uh, uh, Army National Guard, we, we did, I, I recall doing some training over the years where we were outside a lot and in sleeping in a hole. Uh, that's the way it was, as part of the training. But a lot of times we were in warm, comfy barracks too. Uh, we're always out in the hole here. I mean, we're pitching a tent and we're you know, carrying our house on our backs. And cooking everything over a fire. Uh, we don't have anywhere near the luxury that uh, soldiers of today do. There we go, nice fire going. And her hair it hung over her shoulders, tied up with a black velvet band. Before the judge and the jury. Next morning I had to appear, and the judge... For me, it was just personally very gratifying to be here because having grown up in Jacksonville and understanding the, you know, the historical event of Olusti, I just hope everyone appreciates the tremendous uh, heritage that we, we have in this nation and in our state. Uh, we often um, you know, remark about our heritage going back almost 448 years now, so we're, we're the benefactor of, of something very, very rich. And uh, I know I take so much pride in what our soldiers and airmen do today, uh, but just creating an understanding uh, that we're just uh, you know one one member in a long line of events that uh, created this nation, and so it's uh, it's gratifying for me to just be a part of that, and I hope it is for all 12,000 soldiers and airmen of the Florida National Guard. Table to stand, and the very next thing that you know. Me lads, where well, you've landed in Van Diemen's land. I'm going to the side of I'm, I'm leaving. Thank you, gentlemen.